to my soon-to-be husband. I'm so excited to begin this forever life with you, my forever best friend, companion, soulmate, and other half. Here's to doing this dang thing. Natalie Grace, today is the day, the day I get to turn my best friend into my wife. I woke up and couldn't stop smiling this morning. I could not be more excited to be starting this next chapter with you. When I started to think about my speech like a year ago, I was trying to think of the moment I knew when Natalie was going to marry Tyler. And to be honest, there was never one specific moment. It was like a collection of moments. The calm he brings you when you're feeling anxious. The dedication that you guys had when you guys were distance. I do have to say, I handpicked your perfect match. Eli and I made joke that we played Cupid in bringing the two of you together, but God and your angels knew exactly what they were doing. And I don't doubt that your lives together was destined to happen. Nat, you are a pretty remarkable girl to get this guy to settle down. It's not because Tyler is this amazing, handsome stud. Even though you are a stud, Ty, you look really good tonight. Uh, it's because I've been close with Tyler ever since his freshman year in high school, and when it came to girls, he was in absolutely no hurry. When my wife, Rachel, gave Tyler's number to Natalie, I had some doubts about if it would go anywhere. They were living across the country, and Tyler was in no hurry to get into a serious relationship. But a few short weeks after they started talking, I could see a change starting to happen in Tyler. Natalie was definitely the girl that he had been waiting for. happiest girl in the world and I'm so blessed you chose me forever. I vow to love you through all of our ups and downs. I vow to show our children what an unbreakable marriage looks like. Your dreams will be my dreams. Your aspirations will be my aspirations. Where you go is where I belong. I promise to choose you forever. You are and will always be my greatest accomplishment. I love you unconditionally. One step and stumble I wondered why Natalie.
Before I met you, I didn't know that I was incomplete. It wasn't until I found you that I realized I couldn't spend another moment without you. God placed you in my life at the perfect time. I vow, not only today, but for the rest of our lives, to put you before me in all things. I vow to choose you and only you for the rest of our lives. I will be your light when times get dark and your biggest cheerleader during your moments of triumph. Natalie, I love you now and I'll love you always. I, Tyler, in the presence of God and these witnesses, take you, Natalie, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you as long as we both shall live. I, Natalie, in the presence of God and these witnesses, take you, Tyler, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you as long as we both shall live. By their promises, Tyler and Natalie have bound themselves together in marriage before God and these witnesses. Therefore, I declare that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. And now I have the distinct privilege and honor to announce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Tyler Netsky. I've always had the feeling that Tyler is going to do something very special with his life. And today, something very special is happening. And the fact that you guys found each other and love each other so much is something we're celebrating for. So let's raise our glasses to the newlyweds. Just like I'm